I'm Harrison Butler. I'm with uh, Allison Gray here. Um, we want to know first when you started deciding that you wanted to run. Oh, so I actually started running when I was in oh, I was eight years old. My mom was a runner, and I was weird, and I just apparently I wanted to go with her when I was younger. So I was begging my mom to take me. She finally took me, and I kept up, and I've just been running ever since. So you were just. Eight years old, she yeah. married your mom? Yeah, I guess so, yeah. Because, well, she told me, she's like, I'm only taking you if you can keep up. So I was like, okay. And I did, so she just kept taking me, and I've loved it ever since. That's actually a great story. Yeah. That's a great story. Um, how'd you feel about like, your high school career? Highs, lows? Yeah, so when I was a freshman, I went like 11.05 in the two mile, which, I mean, not a lot of people understand running times, but it's that's a really good running time for a freshman. I took like third at state with that time. Um, and then I kind of had a rough middle part because I got injured my sophomore year for about four months. And then it was kind of rocky and I actually almost quit running my junior year. And so, but I mean, I didn't because I don't want to pay for college. I was like, oh, this is the only way I'm going to get a scholarship. Yeah, well, research, <laughs> so, you yeah but I, I did I did end up winning state in the two mile my senior year. Um, Congratulations. You get a yeah. ring for that too? I, if you buy one. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, no. <laughs> um, why'd you choose this? So, Coach Paul and uh, Coach Paul Limp at the time, he, he's not here anymore, but they, when they were on their way to a meet, a college meet, they stopped at my school separately. They drove separately to talk to me, and um, he, I mean, they offered me a lot of money, which obviously is very intriguing. And um, I just had a lot of confidence in the program and just what you told me about the program, I felt like it would be a really good fit for me and I'd be able to um, really, uh, you know, run to my full potential with um, this kind of program. So that was also, you know, yeah. really interesting. And I don't know, it's hard when you're in high school, you don't really know. It's like anyone in college, you're like, oh, this is so cool. <laughs> and so. <laughs> do, uh, do you think the SU is a good fit? Yeah, I do. Um, I feel like Coach Wool, he's been super amazing with me and he's really good at you know listening to his athletes and working with us and um, just his program. It did end up working really well for me and I love the team and it's it's been nice because I, I only live like two and a half hours away from home so it's far enough from home that I'm not, you know, around all the time and they can't just show up at my house but I can go home if I want to. and. Um, yeah, I really enjoyed it here. That's awesome. So, uh, this is a hard one. So take your time. Okay. <laughs> what is the favorite memory you got running the track? My favorite memory? Hey, that one's actually an easy one. So, my my favorite memory is definitely Nationals uh, this past cross country season. Um, that race was really cool, specifically. I mean, it was my very last Nationals uh, race in college, and I had just been running really well, unexpectedly <laughs> well this season. And so um, uh, I just remember going into that race, uh, I just felt, it was weird because it, energy wise I felt amazing, but um, my legs were a little bit more tired than normal that day, but it didn't matter how bad I was hurting. Like I was so willing to go through any amount of pain because I was so determined run well at this race and just to have like that switch in mentality and to be able to like endure so much pain and almost be unbothered by it like it was fine because I wanted to run that you know I, it was more important to me to run you know the best that I could in that race and the last like four 300 meters um my legs got so lactic that I couldn't even feel them anymore so my legs went completely numb. I was, you know, struggling to even stay on my feet. Like if you watch back in the video, I'm like falling as I'm trying to get to the finish line and just to like push my body to that point where like I literally couldn't even feel my legs was just like, it was an indescribable experience. Like it was just crazy. And I was terrified I was gonna fall. And if I did fall, I would not have been an all American, but you know, I crossed the finish line in 20th. I did fall back a lot of places cause I came through with like 800 meters to go in fourth place which was cool until <laughs> I went lactic. But I mean, I still, you know, I still took 20th and it was, yeah, it was 
the coolest race of my life. I, I just can't even explain the feeling that I felt crossing that finish line. I bet. I bet. Never had a feeling like that. <laughs> I couldn't imagine how, uh, how fun that would be. Yeah, see just, how, how you did, how far you pushed yourself, or something like that. Yeah, when you're, you know, running is just one of those sports where it's, it hurts. It just hurts. And if you want to run good, you have to hurt. And so, um, it's, it's, you know, when you, you, it's just so much more satisfying when you, when you do well because of how hard it is and because of how much it hurts. So when you do perform, there's just something about it that is just so, like, I can't even describe it. It's just, the runner's high is a real thing. It really is. I'll ride that high for like a week. I, I daydream about running like good races. I like run it through my head all day. It's just, it's the coolest thing. Running is hard, but it's so rewarding. Yeah, I can see you're competing against yourself really. A lot of yeah. Running. Oh yeah. Yeah. You're pushing yourself and you know, that's the thing. You don't have to like in cross country. It is a team, but it's also individual. Like I don't have to depend on anyone else really I'm in charge of what happens yeah. it all depends on me and um it's yeah it's cool that way you get the team and individual 